Welcome back to SBR Forum Videos. Coaching plays a large factor in the NFL, especially here in the preseason where we're in right now. However, it also does a lot for the team's ATS value in the regular season as well. We have some nice articles up on the forum right now and on the website that highlight this and give you an idea as to what it could look like for some of these brand new head coaches this year, opposed to some of the coaches that have been more established. But if you look at the uh, the argument here, it looks like long term, long tenured head coaches are obviously the better way to go here. Again, the spread wise these coaches tend to have more success in the regular season now there's probably a lot of reasons for that but for instance since 1991 bill belichick is 191 149 and 8 against the spread that's nearly 60 percent that's a uh, very good for a team that the public really likes to back especially too so obviously bill belichick being there a long time having established a system in new england probably gives him an advantage over a lot of these other teams with brand new head coaches for instance there was a lot of teams that changed head coaches this offseason whereas it might be good for the chicago bears or mark tress in two years and went 11 and 19 and 2 against the spread in favor of John Fox, who has a winning record against the spread as well as a head coach. However, might be bad uh, for the 49ers who let go of Jim Harbaugh, who of course had a really good ATS record throughout his career there, and of course got that team to the NFC title game several times at 40, 29, and 3 against the spread. Now going to uh, Tom Sula, who had really unproven at this point in his career. So a lot of instances, I think, where you could, if you're looking to break a tie potentially in a really low spread, go with the long tenured head coach potentially over the uh, guy who hasn't been there very long or maybe even hasn't even been there more than a couple games. So that'll do it for me this time. Make sure you check out that article on sportsbookreview.com. But for SBR Forum videos, I'm Jordan Sharp.